Now, as we've been showing you this morning, so many people have so many different reasons for running today. One of them is a woman whose father was killed in Afghanistan. Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Richardson joins us again from along the marathon route in Brooklyn with her story. Hello again, Kimberly. Hello, Lori. Kelly McGee was just 18 years old when her dad died. Colonel John McGee was killed when his convoy came under attack in Afghanistan in 2010. Well, soon after, Kelly, who had always run with her dad, took things to a new level. And in just a few hours, we'll honor him in a very touching way. I started running with my dad, and he kind of like instilled in me my passion for running. Her father, Colonel John McHugh. He was my hero, but I mean, I think deeper than that, he was, um, he was my mentor. A West Point grad from West Caldwell, New Jersey, who in 2010, while in Afghanistan, was killed by a suicide bomber. Kelly was just 18, living in Kansas with her family at Fort Leavenworth. She remembers the moments before getting the devastating news. I remember telling myself in the car, I was like, this is my last like 10 minutes of normal in my life. And the seconds after. When I went inside and my mom told me it was him, I, I was just shocked and everything after that is kind of surreal. Like I said, I'm still kind of working on, on those memories. The summer after he died, every morning I would just go out and run three miles. And I always, since we lived so close to the cemetery, I always would, after my runs, go at least like walk by the cemetery or go and sit there. That's when Kelly came up with a touching way to pay tribute to her dad, which also helped her cope with the loss. I realized it's like this could be something cool to take on the same three marathons that he did. Now Kelly is literally following in her dad's footsteps. Last spring, she finished the same marathon he did in Lincoln, Nebraska. She plans to one day head to Munich, Germany for that race. As for Pensacola, Florida, that is now a 10K, so instead, Kelly will be running the TCS New York City Marathon. It's been a race that I've known about my whole life um, and that I'm just really excited for. Kelly will be part of Team TAPS, a support organization for Gold Star families. It will be emotional. Running this marathon was on her dad's to-do list. So I'll definitely have a picture of my dad with me. And here at mile eight, I'll be looking for Kelly to give her a big hug. Once again, she crosses the finish line here in New York City. She'll have her sights set on Munich, Germany, the marathon there in order to finish and complete this touching trifecta.